Want to see me do a cartwheel? I'll go fast. Just get her a phone already. On the show, you guys play kids. Some of you guys are teens, you're a younger kid. What kind of kid were you guys? I was sort of the overachiever kid, and I, I just couldn't have any silence, so I just filled my days with activities and work and homework and reading. I just, yeah, I couldn't have any um, relaxation as a child. My back went out when I was in eighth grade. Oh my god! <laughs> my yeah, oh my god. My, my mom would sometimes make me take days off of school and call them personal creative days because I was too um, huh. type A. Yeah, so yeah. That that's a cool mom. Thing. Yeah, that yeah. Is cool. she would she got frame it you. as yeah. She'd be like, "It's a, and my brother would go, "Can I have one?" My mom's like, "No." Yeah. No, not for you. <laughs> Wow. Um, I was, well, I, I'm five. I have no memories of being five. I assume my life was fantastic. I think that's probably the best time of your life, yeah, yeah. frankly. You get yeah. everything, almost everything you want. You're still cute. <laughs> <laughs> and everything you say sounds like some genius pronouncement. So yeah. I'm going to just assume I was blissfully happy then. <laughs> yeah. I just feel like my mom was always sighing. Like I, whatever, <laughs> oh like I just feel like I was always, I wasn't a full disappointment, like not like a bad kid, but she'd be like, the neighbor said you stole a TV from the back of a thrift store and threw it off a cliff. And I'd be like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, what's up? You know, I was that kind of kid. Oh like, sighing. nah, I was, yeah, so it was a lot of just like, okay. <laughs> ah, that'd be Papa Moms. Free pizza, compliments of Papa Moms. Bon appetit. Where did you guys grow up? And if they made a cartoon about where you grew up, what would that look like? Ooh, uh, I'm from Marietta, Georgia, which is like 30 miles northwest of Atlanta. Uh, it's weird because, I mean, gentrification is everywhere, but when I grew up, this is before most people even knew the term, so half of the city truly was dirt roads. Like the mm. apartment complex I grew up in had a cemetery in the front of it oh because God. they had mowed down a church and built oh apartments, God. but they were like, we can't move the bodies. Oh my <laughs> so, God. Oh my God. and the most famous landmark at the time was the world's, uh, or sorry, the, the largest KFC on the Eastern seaboard, wow. and it was called the Big Chicken. So, um, so, but now there's like a New Balance store. So like, wow. yeah, it's a, it's a weird place. I don't know, it'd probably be about KFC. <laughs> Oh my God. Um, well, I grew up in the Pacific Northwest, up in Washington State, and I didn't understand at the time that it was a much cooler place, like Pearl Jam and Nirvana and Hole. And I guess it would have been a super grungy show, like everyone dragging around in plaid and Doc Martens <laughs> and being like super moody and um, going around on their bikes in the rain, which is what I did. <laughs> which is exactly what I did. I grew up in a town of a thousand people, two hours south of Buffalo. So it would be like a show with one stoplight. <laughs> Your game is weak. Oh, and you're tough. That's right. There's no name I haven't been called, no taunt I haven't endured, no body part that hasn't been shamed. I show no mercy and must kill to survive. What shows did you guys watch growing up? And like, what kind of animation do you, is there stuff that you guys like now too? Mm. I wasn't allowed to watch TV when I was, I was allowed to watch the Olympics and the McNeil Lair News Hour. That's what <laughs> oh I was my gosh. Wow. That's what I was allowed okay. to watch. Wow. So I didn't, I, was, I started sneaking out of bed at night to watch like Johnny Carson. That right. was what I would sneak out. I did a lot of sneaking. You did a lot of sneaking. Realizing this is what you do to your kids sneakster. when you don't allow yeah. them, you, they become sneakers. But um, yeah, and so I never saw any animated programming ever oh, until I was crazy. older. So this is like, this even is like, kids animation? Like not really. Or, no, oh. not really. It's crazy. Oh. I was really deprived. Yeah, really I, uh, I I watched like Fresh Prince, Martin, Living Single, uh, and animation wise, I wasn't allowed to watch The Simpsons because Bart told his parents to shut up. Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> and my no. mom was like, never. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> no. I watch. You know, I, I watched. Like, you know, I watched like Ducktales mm -hmm. and like I don't know if you guys remember. There was a show called Hammer Man no. with his MC Hammer's cartoon. Oh. I watched. <laughs> A lot of Hammer Man. <laughs> I want to see that now. Yeah, yeah. And like, oh, wow. like Dragon Ball Z, I guess. I watched a lot of that. Wow. Right. We didn't have cable in my neck of the woods, so I only had the three <laughs> channels. Yeah. So just, you know, TGIF kind of oh, thing. Yeah. We got cable when I was like probably 16. I started watching The State. And that was oh, like, yeah. I was like, oh, comedy, I get it. Like, But before that, I, I thought Full House was comedy. Yeah. I thought Full House was hilarious. And then I was like, oh, there's a different <laughs> thing out there. You are glad I'm your father, right? Yeah. They're about to unmask a celebrity we don't know. Kyle Barnhart!